Welcome back to Good Day. So it's not very often we chat baseball at this time of year. This past October, unless there's some blockbuster trade, but we are today because this Mud Hens game is going to be out of this world. Mm -hmm. Looking forward to it. Mm -hmm. Troy Hammersmith of the Toledo Mud Hens is here to explain all about this cosmic takeover. Thanks for being here today. Yeah, thanks for having me. This is so cool. We are super excited. Everybody's is, excited. Yes. Cosmic baseball. Explain what this is. Yeah, so brand new concept. Uh, something that most have not seen before. Uh, it, it started last year um, in the Coastal Plains League. They, uh, the, the group, you know, put together the first ever glow in the dark, you know, UV baseball game. And it kind of went viral, and you know now they're taking it, you know taking it out for a first ever tour. Love it. I, I, I think we need video. There it is. We need video really to get into this, Troy. To because explain what this, this is, is spectacular. So uh, break down what we're seeing here. No lights with this baseball. Yeah, no lights. Everything is is UV glow, you know, black lighting uh, to create that glow in the dark effect. So first of its kind. Um, so we're really excited that Toledo was one of the seven locations selected for this, you know, first ever tour and. You know, you had first, first ever. You know. So this is. It starts as a regular baseball game. Mm -hmm. It's sun's still out. That whole thing. Yes. Then they've got what I'm looking at. It looks like yeah, there are UV black lights, lights mm -hmm. in. You know where you would have normal lights, sort of. Yeah. So, so they bring that all with them. Yeah, yeah. They, everything you know is gonna you know be brought in, and like you said, it'll start off as a you know regular you know traditional baseball game, and then when the you know when the sun sets, it flips to the cosmic baseball, yeah. and and will be an amazing experience for fans. I love that. So I did see an L screen for the pitcher. That was a concern. Oh, a okay. line drive coming back, but uh, the bases, they glow in the dark. The yep. bats. Yeah, really. Every the element. Chalk line. Yeah, every element you see there will, will, will glow. So the bases, the baseball, the bats, um, you know, and then obviously the, the fans that are there, you know. All you got to bring your gear, don't you? Yeah. So. You have to get the gear so that you glow in the dark. Yeah. Too. So, Troy, this is this is different just all the way around. Uh, anything it, like within the game that changes that we're not used to when it comes the to baseball? Rules and yeah, I think, you know, really with the cosmic baseball, it's not, just, you know, just the, the black lighting glow and the dark effect. I think it's, you know, really it's it's that added entertainment. It's the it's the party that, that they're going to bring with that. You know, a lot of music, a lot of fun, a lot of engagement with fans. So uh, really a first of its kind, and we're, we're lucky to be able to, to bring this to Toledo and, and offer this to our to our community. Like a home run derby situation too? Is yeah, it? I think there's going to be, yeah, some different added effects to it. So I think, you know, just different ways for them to engage engage with fans. Is it still three strikes you're out? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> it's, 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 it reminds me of the cosmic bowling though. And when they mm -hmm. start doing that, it's just just really cool. But yeah, let's bring that here. When we we've talked about Savannah Bananas in the past with the acrobatics and the, the the cool things that they're doing, how important do you think that is for the sport of baseball to start branching out like this? Yeah, I think it's. I mean, I think it's great overall. At the end of the day, you know, there's a lot of baseball enthusiasts and traditionalists like myself but it's nice to continue to have added entertainment and really just keep engaging the game, bringing in new fans and, and creating that excitement. I think that's that this is you know another way for that to happen. So you know, we're excited to be a part of it. Not yeah. everybody sits through a three-hour baseball game <laughs> I know. anymore. Yeah, so th this will keep the kids' attention. And you can see, too, with the video, folks will have T-shirts <laughs> and things like that. So the kids are going to love that indeed. So let's talk about tickets. Tickets. How yes. can I get my hands on tickets? Yes, so great question. It, it is. We've already seen an amazing and overwhelming response. Um, the best way, uh, it's a lottery system. So we encourage fans to you know visit mudheads.com or follow our social channels. Um, yesterday, we, we kind of went live with the the lottery system so uh, definitely need to get your name and in, in, into that um, you know for a chance to to guarantee to you know to get an opportunity to purchase tickets okay so hopefully it's your lucky day you're feeling lucky when you get in that lottery the game itself is going to be August 23rd yes yeah, Saturday August 23rd uh, cosmic baseball will be at fifth third field so put it on your calendar if you need to be there <laughs> you're like, man get this in the calendar now enter get entered into that lottery can people enter the lottery now or when does that open yeah, lottery is now open. Oh, okay. um, so Steven's again, I would, I would, right uh, I would get, uh, start to get your name <laughs> in there. Get, uh, you know, is there a, a certain amount of tickets one person can get? Is it capped at? Uh, right now, it, it's uh, you know we're just seeking um, you know ticket requests. Put okay. your name in the lottery. Uh, put that number of tickets that you're requesting, and then once it opens, um, you know you'll be able to purchase you know as many tickets uh. as you. 
Yeah, like that. You put in there. Okay. All right. He's getting there. Yeah, I'm seeing an article right now. But hey, here we go. Tickets. All right. I'll get to it. Troy, yes. thanks so much. Really appreciate it. This Good is going to be the it. hottest ticket in town. Yo, it, it is. The response already, like I said, has been incredible. Um, we're super excited to be one of those, you know, limited uh, locations for the tour. So act fast. Make sure you sign up for that lottery. And uh, the actual um, tickets will open up here in a few weeks uh, for people to purchase. You know, okay. if, if you all need like an extra, I can play shortstop, <laughs> second base. Hey, we'd love to have you be I a part be of it. Let's, I can be an umpire. I can pitch. The L screen's there, so I, hey. I feel safe, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Amanda, you can join. What about a bat boy? I can be a bat boy. <laughs> <laughs> as long as I can wear a cool uniform, yes. I'm down. Hey, cool. Let's Let's do it. Let's Very do it. cool. Yeah. Troy, thanks so much for Thank being you. here today. Appreciate it. Well, while we're waiting for baseball season, we still have to get through winter. And once the weather turns cold, that means one thing for those who love the Toledo Zoo. That's right. Lights before Christmas. It starts Friday. We want you and your family to win a behind-the-scenes experience at the Toledo Zoo. That would be for six people. You can enter to win until Friday. Text the word contest to 419-248-1100 for the link to enter or go to WTOL.com and click on the contest tab at the top of the homepage. You can enter once per day. Good luck from Good Day. We're back in a moment.